Hi, my name is John Skippy Limco. Welcome to a new Plugin Guru video. Uh, this is a special one yeah. because I'm not obviously in my studio. I'm in a very different location. I'm actually in Germany, believe it or not. I'm at Tommen Music. This is for the Tommen Synth Reactor. It's an opportunity for all of these different manufacturers to meet with different YouTube people. It's a cool opportunity to make relationships with these companies and to show products of theirs that are really difficult to see otherwise. This is an example of something that actually isn't even out yet. This is the Waldorf Kyra. It is one of five in the world that are currently available. Uh, it's supposed to be coming out in June. And I played it with headphones. We have this tint. And we walk into this tent and all these manufacturers are there and this immediately caught my attention just because, um, because of this. It's beautiful sound. And I was like, you know, if I was gonna do a video, it might be good to do it on something that just makes you kind of go, oh my God, with everything you play. So I'm gonna give you a, just a walkthrough this isn't a complete walkthrough. Um, I'm talking to them about sending me one of these when it's done. It's supposed to be out in June, and right now it's March. So there's still time for them to work on it, refine, get some more patches. The patches that are inside of it are already uh, pretty, oh my God. So, and I'll talk a little bit about the layout. As you can see from the interface, it has two oscillator groups. Each oscillator group has a sub oscillator. It has this incredible filter. It has envelopes. It has, I believe, up to nine effects. It's using, it, this is a synth that was originally developed by a gentleman in the UK, and Waldorf is working with him to help it get out quicker to more people. And so this is, it's capable of some mind-blowing specs. It has like 120 voices of polyphony. It can do, I think, eight parts simultaneously. Let me just show you some of the sounds. Um, I'm gonna go back all the way to the beginning so we can start with some basses and we'll go from there. So this is uh, the Waldorf Kyra. And so here's Play Dirty. filter is just so sick. It's beautiful. Here's DX. All you guys that are into the cinematic, to dance. I 80s Carpenter Crunch. Let's listen to this filter for a second. Because as we all know, the heart of any instrument really is the filter. The oscillators and the filter make up so much of what expressivity you're gonna have in the sound. And this filter is just, as you can see, there's all these different types of filters, high pass, band pass, and low pass, as well as dual filters. So the capabilities, I just, okay, here we go to pads. This is a beautiful pad that can go many places. using aftertouch there so that you can
you have a lot of controllability with the aftertouch. To Some other pads. Um, Let's see what else. Oh, this was nice. Lost Kingdom. And just to show you how fun it is, it is fully programmable. There's a lot of parameters on the front interface. You can immediately take this. have a full control of a number of effects here. There's uh, EQ or it can do formant filter type of, of, of tonality shifts. There's distortion, delay, phaser, chorus, and reverb. And so we could take uh, the screen right here is showing you feedback of the type of distortion. There's a mix, so once you get a sound that it's tapered down, so a little added personality. So instead of that really pure. It's very easy to add a little extra oomph and different personality to the sound very easily but distortion is one of my favorite tricks for taking sounds that are kind of tame and just kind of doing its thing and like giving it personality and bringing something unique out of it so distortion there's a number of types of distortion it's not just one so there's a lot there to play with uh, this is really fun this is vocal fragments so you can I mean, that filter, again, you just hear all this cool yummy, like, oh, wow. I really, it's ear candy stuff to hear nice things like that. Um. Distortion, but when it's down in darkness, it's just this added stuff in the sound. Love it, love it, love it. So I've only had like an hour to play with this to get into it just a little bit. take long when something has this type of unique flexibility you can hear it in the different sounds that are being called up oh this is cool revenant one and two so go from that to two and you hear it didn't cut off Oh, it does cut off there. So sometimes maybe if it's with similar parameters, it can play without cutting off. Maybe sometimes it can't. You know, that's, I'm not sure how that works. So here's some of the lead sounds to go into a little bit different category. It 
does have a hyper saw oscillator as well as waveforms. Definitely hear the hyper saw effect. Again, there's just so much personality to this. change all the parameters. Very fun. Uh, Call of the Valkyrie. Here's a good example of the filter. Listen to the filter with resonance. types of overtones. <laughs> Horizons. that behind a sample brass layer and that quality would really thicken and enrich it and it would be very nice. So this is just a taste of what this synth can bring. excited. So, Kyra, something new coming later this year from Waldorf that I am very excited about. And after you hear this, I hope you are too. Thank you for watching and we will see you in the next video.